Monday, residents of Norwood and across most of Massachusetts experienced strong winds and heavy rain, causing downed trees and power outages. On Monday, April 13th, we had a windstorm that came through Norwood and created a little bit of havoc with the, uh, our electrical system. During the course of the evening, we, we were inundated with more than 1,100 calls for no power, the majority of which were feeder outages. A typical feeder will have anywhere from 800 to 1,200 residential customers on it. Uh, one of the, the feeder outages was along the Chapel Street feeder, which includes Walpole Street. That went out at approximately 5.18 p.m. that night. It was caused by trees and right near 420 Walpole Street. In addition, we had two feeders go out simultaneously. That occurred in front of 5 Cross Street. A large tree came down and hit one of the poles where there's a tie point between those two feeders causing both those feeders to trip out simultaneously. That occurred at 523. We performed some switching and we got most of the feeder back by 6.30 p.m. We had to do additional repairs to get the remainder of Cross Street, Plimpton Ave, and some other side streets in those areas back. Those were given power back approximately 821 that night. In addition, there were a variety of calls that came out came throughout. Uh, individual homes, areas of town, that smaller areas of town who lost power. The customer service reps and the station operators did a great job of handling all those calls. Then out in the field, the linemen and the electricians did a great job, and along with the supervisors, of making sure we could get power back to as many people as quickly as possible. The DPW was also extremely busy during the storm, clearing fallen debris from the roads. The DPW is offering free tree cleanup through April 22nd. As always, great work by both the Light Department and the DPW.